What is going on, everyone? Samurai Solo, and I am back with EA Sports UFC 4. And today I'm going to begin some fights in with Edmund Shabazian in the middleweight division. He's going to be taking on Jack Hermanson this Saturday. And yeah, I was looking up the card for this Saturday. And the main event, obviously, is a banger. Rob Fon and Cody Garbrandt. Fight I cannot wait to see. Fantastic. But honestly, at a quick glance that I did, I really wasn't super impressed with the, with the card. But it's MMA on a Saturday night. I'll be home. I'll be watching it. And But the one fight that also intrigued me was Shabazian and Hermanson. You know, especially for Shabazian. Both guys are coming off losses. But for Shabazian, he's coming off his first career loss. And he was thought of very highly. You know, people were really hyping him up. He had a, a few uh, really quick, nice knockout victories. I remember over Brad Tavares. He had that beautiful, I think it was a jab into the lead head kick knockout. He had a nice uh, finish over Charles Bird with those elbows when Bird was shooting for a takedown. And, you know, and on Dana White's Tuesday night, what's it called? That Tuesday night contender show Dana White has. You know, that's how he got his contract. He blitzed the guy he fought there. And, you know, like I said, he was thought really high of it. And he ran to Derek Brunson. And I think a lot of people thought, Brunson was going to get rolled over on that, that Shabazi was just going to roll over him with no problem, but that ended up not happening. And he took a really brutal loss. I mean, he was pretty much knocked out in the second round. The fight should have been stopped there, but they let him go out for another round and he got finished shortly after. And it, it's just going to be things a little high. Do I want to play this? Yeah, we'll play it. And if it's lag, I can just quit out. It's not too bad though. And it's going to be interesting to see how a fighter like that comes back from that. I know he's a young guy. Coming off a brutal loss to see if this helps him or not. And and Hermanson's a tough matchup because Hermanson is so tough. He can go all day. He has great cardio. And that's another thing with Shabazz and his cardio is kind of coming into question. I think rightfully so. I remember when he fought Darren Stewart, he was exhausted in that fight. And he he also slowed down pretty good against Brunson as well. And Hermanson's a grappler. He's a wrestler. But Hermanson's kind of weird on the feet. He's kind of herky-jerky. And Shabazzian does have some sharp striking, especially his hands. He has nice kicks too. And um, we'll see what happens. Let's focus up here, though. And take him down. Wasn't really looking to grapple too much, but let's try it. Or some of these body punches here. Oh, he got that. Huh. He wants to take down. And, you know, rightfully so, he is using GSP. Nothing wrong with that. Watching for that takedown. So he's going to be able to get some kicks on me that he probably shouldn't. Just because, nope. He's going to get some takedowns on me that he probably shouldn't because I'm worried, or some strikes, I mean, some head kicks on me because I'm worried about the takedown, like from this distance. Oh, he's backing away. Body might stay there, try to return fire. Might get that one. Yeah, he got that one on me. All right, he wants to grapple so much. We might just have to end up making this a grappling match, guys. I was willing to keep it on the feet, but he's really hell bent on taking us down here. Oh, he got that. Hmm. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Oh, he got that before I could even do anything. Good job. Good job. Okay, we're out. Take our time. Let's go and get side control. Let's watch out for that crucifix. I'm not going to let that happen again. I was already trying to transition out, and I couldn't, so... Choice got that. Ninety seconds remain in the round. I think Shabazzian has like a no. Yeah, I, I do. I should have known better than doing that. I know better to uh, not do that. Just to sit there, pretty much. Let's go and get half guard. That way he doesn't just wreck our body over and over. He's not even gonna posture. No. Nope, block that one. Half guard. Block that one. Full guard. We'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. Okay. 
Shouldn't even worry about sweeping him here. It's not even that much time left, but you know, why not? There we go. Just wanted to get a few shots on him. Let him know we're here. Um, I'm gonna have, I, I'm gonna have to pressure him. Like even at uh, because if I just hang back, he's just gonna keep going for takedowns, takedowns, takedowns. I need to get him uncomfortable. I'm not really much of a pressure fighter, but we're gonna have to come at him a little bit here, pressure a little bit. He's just gonna be really desperate for the takedown. Away. My stamina is dead. He's going to go for another takedown. I'm watching for it. And he knew that one. Gotta watch my stamina though. I need to put pressure, but I need to watch my stamina too. Those elbows are going to be there for me. I don't like spamming double elbows, but three minutes to go. Stuff nope. the takedown there. How good is his takedown? Yeah. You see how much oh, huge elbow. Oh, now the and he got that when I was about to punch him. But we've rocked him and dropped him, so I'm more than happy. Look at his stamina. Remember, you lose more stamina now when you when you fail takedown attempts, so it works out pretty well. Right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying nope, to hip escape. not this time. Oh, let him up. Couldn't even let him up in time because he was able to sweep me. Oh, that's annoying. I should have been patient. Trying to see what submission Sebastian has. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. St. Pierre's kick to the body. That one blocked by the defense. Oh! That's what I went for. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, and the ankle kick. Oh. Down. We'll see if he oh, he got it. Got the ankle kick. I thought I had stopped that one in time. Gets right back up. I mean, what, an what the heck happened there? Don't do that again. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Final seconds here of round number. See, that's one thing I don't like is that I get gassed out too from trying to stop these uh, takedown attempts. He's more gassed than I am, but like I should not be that gassed from, from stopping his takedown attempts. Especially like maybe a turning takedown because you have to work a little bit for it, but he's not even doing turning takedowns. I'm just straight up stopping his takedowns and it's like made me more gassed. And, I know he's more gassed, but it's made me gassed enough. So yeah. He does that little oh, side movement I'm gonna like he's gonna do now, elbows. Another elbow. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, straight right. This time I slipped there. Not getting that man. Nice strike to the midsection glances. I get rocked. Dang it, I was about to just punch him. Oh, good, I stopped that. I'm unsure if I stopped that one. I was, I was about to punch him. I was like, he's going to get rocked. He has no stamina. Just over three minutes to go in our third and final round. Oh, he might be out. 
for an elbow there, not quite happening. I'm ready for that. And now he engages in a boy. Whoa! Oh! These are bad. That is it. He's done. He's done. And I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up. Yeah, I, I don't like. I, I I know they did some more tweaking where I I still lost stamina from slapping those takedowns, but he lost more. I think they did like where they lose even more for doing it, but still, I should not. I just feel like I shouldn't be losing that much stamina from that at all but at least he lost more than me he was way more gassed one thing i noticed is if i'm not mistaken i don't think he ever attempted a turning takedown and gsp i know for a fact has turning takedowns um that was kind of interesting yeah once we started kind of pressuring him it kind of i got rocked a couple times because you know he is gsp and i am using shabazi and who i don't know what his chin rating is we'll check his stats out here real fast um I knew I was, you know, get a couple rocks, but I had to put that pressure because he was just going to keep, he was doing takedowns no matter what. Yeah, 88 chin. You got to be extremely careful with his chin. And this is who I knew we were going to be facing, Robert Whitaker, man. This is going to be tough because Whitaker's like a, like, like a, like a lightweight featherweight fighter where you can throw all day with him and never get tired. On top of that, you have the ridiculous power, the ridiculous speed, the ridiculous everything with Whitaker and we're using Edmund, so. I don't even know what Edmund's ground game is like, what his ratings are. I should have looked that up, too. I might even try to take uh, Whitaker down. We'll see how it goes here. Every fight starts on the field. I do plan to keep fights standing, but we'll see. Let's see what kind of Whitaker player. Because we're playing one of those Whitaker players out. Just bum rush you. Man, I can get ugly quick. I throw a leg kick. No? That's actually a pretty patient Whitaker. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Whitaker gets tattooed with that hook. He's going to have to change some things here. Archer, there's the only takedown. Pretty evident, DC. That Just to let him know we'll take him down. Just want to let him know that, like, we will do, we will shoot takedowns. I stopped that. Yep. Let's see what he does from this position. Oh, his opponent squirming like a fish out of water. Stamina high. Now let's go ahead and spin around. Let's go ahead and see if we can get it back here. Take our time. Get our stamina back up before we do anything. Block that. Take our time. Back flat. Now let's drop some ground and pound. That's great. Get our stamina. Gotta watch my stamina. Nope. Not getting that. And he quit. <laughs> oh, man. That's funny. He just said, I'm done. I mean, like, if you're going to just quit when the fight hits the ground, then just play stand and bang. You know what I mean? Like, that's what I would do. I wouldn't even bother playing. To, if, I, like, if I just hate the ground game so much and just going to quit right out, I would just, um, just play stand and bang mode. I, I didn't, like I said, I didn't plan to really take him down, but I can tell it's like he's going to start pressuring. You saw how he was doing those little body uppercuts and everything like that. I said he's going to start pressuring us and letting these body shots rip. Let me just slow the pace down a little bit. I didn't even plan to keep him there the whole time. I just wanted to let him know, like, hey, there's a threat of the take and you got to watch out for. But um, he had enough. And, yeah, with uh, Shabazi, he does have the turning takedowns to the left. Where uh, He doesn't have it to the right, though. So that is something to know. Not, not that you're going to run into many Shabazi players, but if you do, the only turning takedown he has is to the left side, whether it's a double or single leg. What's he going with, kickboxer sniper? Okay. Oh, I forgot to look up Shabazian's ground stats, but that's okay. Coming up next, we get to this UFC middleweight division fight. I'm not even sure if Shabazzian has an ankle pick or not. And it's got on the short shorts, short denim shorts there. Let's see what we got here. 
see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult hook. to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus Got the side kicks. Who's going to be the one? Just trying to see what he's throwing here just to get an idea. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. You going to throw a side kick or leg kick at me? No. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Oh, that camera angle. Uh, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Well, there's a takedown attempt. No Looking speed. for a takedown? Go for it there, but unable to get the fight to the ground. Whenever your opponent knows that you're that kick, why did they give me a body kick for it? It happens too much to me in this game. It's really annoying. Because Shabazian's lead head kick is four stars, so... We're gonna end up pulling those hooks when he throws them. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Throwing a lot of kicks because he's kind of circling a lot and doing side lunges. Good strategy to stop that is the leg kick. Well, we're not stop him, but. Turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Big kick lands. Yeah, that's why I don't want to throw anything too much there. Oh man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw. Well, that combo up. Oh, I paid for it though. Oh, I, I went for my double elbows. I landed them, but he got them on me. Got to remember that. 88 Shabazian chin. Blocks the shot. Well, missed on that one. Oh, that body shot missed. Yeah, I got to remember to protect Shabazian's chin here. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Oh. There we go. Oh, he didn't sprawl out like I thought he would. If I get crucifix, I'm going to go straight forward. Nice. I do know Shabazzian has that. And another guy quit. <laughs> uh, go ahead and do one. I think we'll do one more fight, guys. Maybe two more if the first one ends quick. This next one. I just saw the opportunity for the takedown and took it. I'm kind of facing these players that want to... Well, that guy was... Uh, the Robert Whitaker play was... I could tell was about to start bum rushing us. But this guy was wanting to hang back a lot. Um, so once I rocked him, I said... Uh, you know, I was, trying to, I was trying to land a strike there. I couldn't because the way he was blocking and circling. So let's go for the takedown. Control him a little bit. That is one thing I know about Shabazzian is that he has the uh, crucifix. Oh, you know what? Let's see his stats real fast. Let me see, like, his... Uh, I know his I know his stand up stats. Takedowns are eighty nine, not bad. Uh, what's his ground game like? Top control eighty seven, bottom eighty six. Yeah, submissions eighty nine. So yeah, you know, not not that great actually. I'll, obviously, like player skill comes into play too. So like you know, if you're if you're if you're going up against a, you know, one of these top players, they could use CM Punk. I could have GSP. They could control me on the ground. You know what I mean? Like it doesn't matter. But it it, it, it definitely can depends. And we're going up against Vanderlei. And again, with Vanderlei's punching power and Shabazzian's chin, man, now I wish I would have even looked up his chin rating now. Because <laughs> now I already do probably want that great, but yeah, 88's pretty bad. And while he does have good punch power, it's not like it's not like GSP, I think, has an 88 chin too, doesn't he? But GSP's incredible everywhere. Shabazzian is not. Touch gloves? Appreciate it. Oh, I went to slip that, but I came out of the slip too early. Good thing I helped block. And every year he turns 21 years old. It's time. I never heard him do that commentary before where they're talking right now, Cormier and uh, Anik. I wonder if they had a new commentary one of the patches. Oh, that should have been a rock or a drop. He was moving his head too. It did a lot of damage. Take our time. Let him have that. Let's go ahead and throw a leg kick. Oh, bad time to throw it now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Still nice body kick landed. Oh, nice. Silva's overhand punch to the head doesn't get to the target. He telegraphed that one and it gets blocked. I was expecting a. Berserker Vander uh, Vanderlei Silva player. He's not doing that really. Just over three minutes to go. I meant to throw the look hook. That was my fault. Not the look, the hook. Watch it for that overhand. That he's gonna throw it. Right there, wow. it was good night that 
big kick lands. Watch for that body kick. I want to step in with it. Oh, no, he caught me. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. I didn't interrupt that. Couldn't. Oh, he connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. High amplitude elbow here. It's blocked. And they separate. Big left hand lands upstairs. Switching stances here. If he tries to circle out again. That kick. He's just going to keep blocking high, I have a feeling. Could probably start going low a little bit. He missed with that jab attempt there. No, he's not. He knows better. Now he gets back in range. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard. The thing with those silver hooks is they're so awkward, like, because they're unique to him. So, like, they're hard to time to move your head back. Because you don't see him. That's the different speed, different animation. Wow, it's really taking us down with Vanderlei. Let's do it then. He's gonna posture up. I'm pretty much just waiting for that. Yeah. Both fighters get up now. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, good opportunity to do damage here. He's got that tight clinch. Good first round. Not too much happening though. When it says you probably won the previous round, that means you won the round. One judge might have given it to him, but we won that round. He threw that body kick a lot. I did notice at the end, though, he switched up and did throw a head kick at me. So I got to watch out for that. Kind of just eat those body kicks or anticipate him. And also, I was trying to do earlier, I was trying to anticipate the step in with punches. My stamina is a little worse, I guess, from those body or that body work he did. There we go. That'll work. I want to miss too many strikes, but at least it's a regular strike we're missing. Got him with that elbow. Some good shots tonight, but there's no three piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're gonna sit there at the drive thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food. Interesting Vandalay Silva player. Give him the hook. Oh, he was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. He's being patient. You know what I mean? Like, you expect a more aggressiveness, especially since I'm using Shabazian, but he's actually hanging back still. Oh, head kick. Oh, my goodness. I went. Y'all yeah, know I like to throw a combo afterwards, a straight right lead hook. And I should have known better doing that. You can do. You can, if I'm using a good, better fighter, I can do that. Got to be more careful here. Man, what a fight. And boy, did I pay for that. He went for a oh, takedown on me, too. Pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the... Oh, oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's oh, my goodness. That just messed me up bad. Look at my stamina. Go. We got it back. Didn't really. Matter. This is another thing I'm not a fan of. Is that that full mount against defensing? That that's ridiculous. That doesn't. That just doesn't happen. I didn't even want to do. I all. I should have just got up. I mean, he was able to get up anyway. I gotta watch my stamina. My stamina is a problem right now. Like he might have landed there instead, a swing and a miss by Silva. I've won the round because we both dropped each other, but he's kind of rock. Just out of range with that strike. Block that one. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Got him with that hook, but I need a strike in return. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. 
Oh, he still got his ground there. I think I got that one off. Lead overhand, yep. He thought we were going to go to the body because his health was low. Now, body. Up. Oh, the hook to the head didn't want to come out there. It's okay. We've won the round. We don't take taunt serious. We're easily winning this fight, but I still have to be careful because I'm Shabazi in with that chin. Definitely our round, though. Got to remember, just throw by combos, and that's it. Don't try to land an extra one. Don't get greedy, basically. That's how I got dropped, pretty much. I didn't know he's lost both rounds. See, right there, it's fine. That's a little setup I do, but, like, I can't throw, like, a big one there and then try to do something. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. All right, look, to take him down even. Front kick. Boom. Take him down. What's going on? There we go. Well, it's not to take that I wanted to do, but... I don't think Shabazzin has to throw or something's going on there. I'll try and do it. At this point, he can have all the body kicks he wants. I'm not worried about that right now. I'm just going to block high. What does he do? ball? We have better. We have, actually, we have same as I think, more or less even. Risky lay kick by me there. I thought he would just keep backing away. Timed him. Beautiful. Look at it take me down. You're not going to do anything with the takedown at this point. And just like that, back to a standing position. We'll see who has the advantage. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Big knee there to the chest. Oh, huge elbow. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nope. Stem in the back. I'm content winning the decision. I'm really not going to do anything crazy. I think I went for an elbow there. Got the hook on me first. That's got to be it, right? Man, he's good. He's got that down. Good. He goes to sprawl out. He yeah, he does. Oh, my stamina's dead. I can't do anything. Just get up. Just get up. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Silva gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. He's content losing the decision. What is that going to do? <laughs> That's going to do nothing. You've lost the fight. I guess it's a moral victory for him. He didn't even try to pass or posture up real quick. I guess he just wanted to go three rounds. It's fine with me. I could have stepped on the gas there, you know, and probably got him out of there, but I'll take that. Very interesting Vanderlei player, though, playing... Uh, you know, hanging back a lot. That's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand up. And that show tonight as he Go ahead and hear the judges' scorecards here. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 30 26. Declaring the winner. 30 26. That means we got one round 10 8. Probably the third round. All right, guys. That's going to go ahead and do it for this one. I do appreciate y'all watching. We'll see how Shabazian does this Saturday. It's gonna be, I'm, I'm leading towards Hermanson, but we'll see what happens. Um, I will catch you all next time. I hope you all have a great day. Stay safe. Take care. Peace.